Hey folks, in today's video tutorial, I'm going to answer to your question how to create with the layers in the drawing and also how we can reuse the predefined preferences from Creo model or assembly into drawing. So let's start. We will start really from the scratch. So we will create new 3D model. And for example, the name will be Q1. And I'd like to create really the default shape. So really I will create only the base plate and it will be not so big thickness. Yeah, some dimension doesn't matter. Over here, my idea is that I like to create a few holes so we can use the standard holes. And for example, we will specify some dimension, some the bigger one, yeah? And if I will select the references, we have the first hole and if we will create another hole, we can repeat it really simply and from drop down menu I will create another one and if you will select the offset references we have a second hole. As you can see directly the system create holes where the 3D nodes is created and also if I will uh, switch to control 5 the, we can see the wireframe diff different display style so you can see that right now we can see also the surfaces from the hole. And maybe it's a wish that in the drawing sometimes you would like to see the surfaces from the hole and sometimes not. So what is possible to do? If I will select Control 2 or I will select this one, you can see here Control 2, Control 5 and so on, yeah? the shortcuts. We are able to manage the layers. The full video tutorial it has been created a long time ago and directly based on this the question has been raised from you. Thank you for this question and let's continue. So I will jump to view manager and over here we are able to create different layers visibility and for example I will create a new one and over here I will specify the holes will be visible yes or no or threat doesn't matter yeah so select the name and now the layer in the view manager is activated and for example if I will select these two objects and I will hide the system will automatically show me that I have modification of the layer and I will select the save mode the system will save it. What does it mean? We will create a new hole and now I like to create the additional standard hole for example like this some dimensions and we will specify the offset references and all dimension what are necessary and for example you don't want to see the 3d node so simple select the node and don't show the node so now if i will finish the hole the node will be not created but control 5 for the quick overview now you can see that the two holes are without the thread but new hole is with thread the question if you would like to also hide it or not maybe we will create the the new layer I will specify in hole 3. In hole 3, I will hide only this one. Yeah, so I will set the save and now we can select. Double click to holes. Over here are no visibility. And if you will apply all visible, yeah, maybe we can select like this and specify that all will be visible. So simple to say, we have a lot of combination that two holes are hidden, yeah, two, two threads or three of them or everything is visible. Now your question is if you can maintain this also in the drawing. Simple to say directly no, because you are not able to specify the layer visibility. But what you can do, you are able to specify from the view manager the combined state. Over here in the view manager, if you select the all tab, now you are able to create and specify the combined state. So what does it mean? We will create a new combined state and the combined state will be, for example, the two holes here. Yeah? So I would like to specify the name H2. And now the system asks me if I would like to create copy or reference original, doesn't matter because we will start from scratch by edit definition. And now it's a big things what you are able to do. From the orientation, you can specify, for example, you would like to see the top view. 
if you would like to see the representation, yes or no. And also you can specify the cross-section, appearances, how the object will be visible. And last but not least, is about the layers. So now, for example, I will applic applicate for the H2 holes. Yeah, the combination, if I will use the preview, the system will show me the orientation and what will be visible in the drawing. And if I will come from OK, then the first combined state is created. If I would like to create a new one, for example, H3, I will create again copy and we are able to make the same modification. So view will be, for example, top, representation master, no cross section and layers will be, for example, H3, yeah, holes 3. If we will use the preview, nothing is visible and this is what we would like to see in the drawing. Simple to say, confirm everything what you want. And now if I will select Ctrl 2 and for example, you would like to see this combined state directly here in 3D. It's really easy. You can go back to view manager in the all and you are able to select display combined views. So what is good? Yeah, you can see that H2, A3 is here. And if you will select the, for example, H2, the system will change it for me. H3, it's directly visible also. So it's up to you how you would like to visible and see and maintain the data. So let's go back and continue. Our wish is to see this combination in the drawing. So simple select and create new drawing. So I will select button control and we will specify that we would like to create new drawing and you are able to use drawing model file name. So the drawing name will be also Q1. When we will confirm OK, the system will request the use template or format. For this quick example, we can simply select, for example, empty A3 format. And when I finish the finish button, the system will ask me what the representation I like to use. For now, simple master representation is good enough. And we would like to continue to show and create a general view in the drawing. So simple, select the icon general view. The system asks me what are the combined state I'd like to use. I will not use the nothing, so it will be only no combined state because I'd like to show you how you can do it. So simple, you can select, you can orient, you can specify the display. Yes, yeah? so for example, we would like to see the hidden line, for example. If I will apply, now everything is visible here. And if you will specify the Bioframe or no hidden, it's up to you, yeah. And also we can specify the how the tangent edges will be visible. And what I'd like to focus is that we would like to jump to the view states. Yeah, so if I will supply apply, and over here you can select for example H2 or H2, A3. So really the system immediately the allow to you to change the combined state. So what does it mean? If you will select new general view and because sometimes you hit this button, do not prompt for combined state anymore and you forgot. So you really need to know what it is. So if you will hit the H3, the system will really automatically make the orientation for you. And also in the view states, the H3 is visible and then you can play it with how you would like to visualize it the display option or if you would like to use the hidden line and so on and so on. So please check the variance, the drawing view, preferences and apply changes as you wish. So in this example, you have seen how it is possible to create and combine state and also how you can maintain and edit the preferences by view manager and also how to deal with the layers. If you will do it on the assembly mode, you can hide the components. If you are working in the 3D model, you are able to hide the surfaces, datum planes and threads and so on. So simple to say about the features. Thank you again for a question. Stay tuned and bye bye.